You know, your wedding pictures may be the most important pictures of your life. So how do you make sure you capture the right moments? Shannon Smith is live at the Embassy Suites where there's a wedding show this weekend. Good morning. Good morning, Cindy. It's one of those things you want to think about and have planned out before the wedding, getting a good photographer and talking these things over with him. And Mike Michike is here and giving us that advice. Good morning. Good morning. So you say there's really three shots you should think about getting, right. capturing the overall moment of your wedding. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot to do throughout the day because we're shooting from six to eight hours, maybe 10 hours at most. Mm -hmm. But the three most important, I think, are going to be your bridal portrait for the bride, whether it's inside of the studio before the wedding or the day of. Let's take a yeah. look at you sent us an example and right. it can be it doesn't have to be a close-up headshot it no. can be anything you want it to be. It kind of depends on where the the venue they choose. If it's a really amazing venue you want to show off the architecture and the character as well as the beauty of the bride. And yeah. that can be done day of or in studio previously yeah. to the Yeah wedding. I mean you know in years past it was studio all the time but trends have changed and now the bride expects the modern look the fresh the natural light so nine out of ten times we're going to shoot on location mm -hmm. either two to three months before the wedding or the day of let's talk about that fun picture this has yeah. really become a huge trend for, for couples sure. yeah i mean the fun shot really a lot of time it's just more of a blooper it, yeah. it can happen off the cuff you don't have to overthink it it's just simply you know it, it might happen a bunch of the times it might happen throughout the evening most of the time it's going to happen in the reception yeah especially if you know a couple people have a little well one too many oh yeah so and, and the once bloopers they relax come out. and everybody's yeah. gotten the vowels right and and right. done what they need to do and then the next one you say you really want to catch a romantic moment right between the couple for sure the examples i brought today the canvas right here in the center the beach portrait and then the one down below on the stand up mm -hmm. Romantic shots are amazing to get because that's really what's going to set the tone for the whole day. I like to get romantic shots if they're, you know, interested in doing a first look. You've got the, the crying potential, the eye contact, just the amazing quality there. Then right after the service, I sneak them away for like 10 or 15 minutes to get some beautiful, you know, shots again of them, but also showing off where they're having the day. Right. Uh, and then lastly, your first dance. It might be a really tight shot where we're zooming in on the expression or backing off as well. Yeah. And it's, I think it's when you're done with the ceremony, like this couple walking away here, right. you kind of relax and you become yourself and that's totally. where the romance comes in, don't you think? I think so. And again, by knowing the couples beforehand and building the rapport, it makes, it makes it so much easier to get that because, you know, they feel comfortable with you. They're going to let their guard down. They can actually breathe. And, and sometimes it's going to be a, a, a beautiful rom romantic shot where they're looking at each other. Sometimes they're looking back at me. Sometimes he's dipping her. You know, it's again, it's just more about being in the moment, off the cuff, not overthinking it. All right. Well, thanks so much for the advice. Yeah, Love thank the you. photographs as well. Very, very pretty. And Cindy, they are the photographs you look back on probably most. You bring them out, you show your kids, mm -hmm. you reminisce about them. You want those moments to be captured. Definitely. You do, Shannon. Thank you. The wedding fair, by the way, at the NBC Suites is this Sunday, January 10th from noon until 4. You can go to 33bride.com for more information.